Okay, sixth grade, lesson 90. This is on measuring turns, which will be a little bit of geometry today. Okay, let's go do a quick review. Okay, draw like a cross on your paper. Okay, and what we're going to do is, let's say I'm in the middle right here, and I'm looking at four streets. Okay. You see what I'm saying? The one that goes in front of me, so I can't really draw a cross like right here. So this one's going this way. I'm walking this way. This one, I'm walking this way. This one, I'm walking this way. And this one, I'm walking this way. You understand? Uh-huh. Okay. Now, if I was walking this way and I turned and started walking this way, how much of a degree turn did I make? 90. 90. Good job. Okay. So let's start adding them up. Okay. So if I was walking north, and I turned and started walking east, I turned 90 degrees. But let's make another turn. Now I'm walking south, uh huh. which is how many degrees have I turned all so far? 180. 180, good job. All right, walking south and I make another turn. Uh -huh. 90 times three, nine times three is 27 with a zero. It's 270. 270, okay. And then I turn back to north. That's 94, 360. 50. Very good. Okay? I know that one. So, those are the four numbers you're going to see a lot. The circle is a little uneven. Okay? Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> okay? And do you know what it's called when I'm going this way? This way around the circle? A complete. It is called a complete circle. But what they call it in math is clockwise. Oh. Why? Because a clock moves this yeah. way. Starts from 12 and goes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay. That's called clockwise. So guess what it's called when you go this way around? Counter clockwise. Okay? The opposite is counter. I don't know why it's called counter. It's <laughs> not like a counter, <laughs> okay? But I don't know if you've heard of counterpart, um, counterclockwise. I'm trying to think of other counter. Counter offer. Someone offers to buy a house, and I say, um, I want to sell it for 150,000, and they give me a counter offer, means they did gave me a different offer. I want to give you only 140,000 for your house, and I either accept the counter offer or decline it. So that's what counter means, opposite basically. Okay. Okay. So clockwise is going the way clock goes. Counterclockwise going the opposite way. Okay. okay. So if I started going this way, then this one would be 90. 90 degrees left, 180, 270, and 360. You understand? So a complete turnaround is what? Uh, 360. 360. Very good. 360 degrees. That's good to know that a full circle is 360 degrees. Got it? Now, now that we've kind of learned those few things, you might want to write on there counterclockwise and clockwise, or do you think you'll remember that? Uh, I think I'll know that. Okay, good. All right, ready? We're going to put a person up here. And again, I'm going to draw a cross. This is north, east, whoops, south, and west. Okay? Never eat soggy waffles. Okay? Ready? All right, it tells me that Leela was traveling north. She's going. And at the light, she turned 90 degrees to the left. Okay. She went this way. Okay? 90 degrees. And she's walking. <laughs> okay? And it says, and then she traveled one block to the next intersection. And at this intersection... She turned 90 degrees more to the left. 90 degrees 180. more to the left. Okay? Then it says, what direction is Leela traveling now? South. South. Very good. So you would say, my answer is south. All right? You got it? Yep. Let's try another one. All right, you can, you, you can, you want to come up here and help me or you want me to? I don't care. Do it? Come on up here. All right, Andy and Barney. You want to be Andy or Barney? I'll be Barney. Okay, you're Barney and I'm Andy. Andy, okay, we're doing north, east, 
south and west. Okay. Now, let's get out of the Okay, you're not going. You're not going to wait. We're good. All right. So, Andy and Barney were both facing north. Andy, which is me, made a quarter turn, which do you know what quarter means? Quarter is one fourth yeah. of a turn, which, which this is what? one, two, three, four. So one, it's okay. basically one ninety degree turn. Okay, Barney, or I'm sorry, Andy made a quarter turn, which is ninety degrees clockwise, to face the east, while Barney turned counterclockwise, one ninety degree turn, and he was facing one ninety. I'm sorry, ninety oh. one. 90 degree turn. Uh, okay. Not 190. Yes, good catch. Okay. While Barney turned counterclockwise in Barney. order to face east. So you're north and you're going to go counterclockwise. So 90 degrees, time out. 180 degrees, 270 degrees, so that you are facing east as well. Let me okay. make sure we read that right. Andy made a quarter turn, which is 90 degrees clockwise to face east. While Barney turned counterclockwise to face east. How many degrees did Barney turn? Um, Let's start back again. 360. Or no, 360. so North this is north. Turn. So one turn, two, two turn, turns, three turns. three turns, and three times 90 is 270. 270. Okay, so how many degrees did Barney turn? Two. 270. Very good. To face east. We got it. All right. Now, you feel like you understand it pretty good? Yeah. All right, last one. And we're going to talk about this girl. Her name's Elizabeth, and she's at the park. So here she is at the park, and that's the track. Okay. This is the grass. Okay, there's our track. Now, um, okay, let's not do that way because she's going to make several turns. This one only has one turn two turns and back. So we're gonna have to do more turns. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna read it first and then we'll set it up. Elizabeth ran each lap around the park. She made six turns to the left and never to the right. Okay. What was the average number of degrees of each turn? Now, because there's six, each turn is not gonna be 90 degrees. Yeah. Because that was if there were four turns. So. Watch what I'm going to do. So we're going to start her right here. And because it's six turns, it's going to end up making a hexagon. hexagon. Good call. Okay, so I'm going to do my best to draw a hexagon. One. Two. Three. Good job figuring that out. Okay, so she starts here and she makes a turn. Now she's going this way. Okay, so, so she's going this way. Instead of keep going straight, she makes a turn. See what I did? Mm -hmm. That much degree turn. Now she's going this way. Dun, 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 dun. And instead of going straight, she makes another turn. This a much degrees turn. Now she's walking this way. Dun, dun, dun. Instead of going straight, she makes a another turn. Now she's walking this way. Dun, 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 dun. Instead of going straight. She makes a, another turn and going this way. And instead of keep going straight, she makes a, another turn. She's almost there back home. So she keeps going, keeps going, keeps going. And instead of keep going straight, she makes a, another turn. And she's completed her cycle. How many turns did she make? One, two, six. three, four, five, six. Very good. Now, the question is, how much was each turn? Well, what did I tell you one full circle makes? 360. 360. And how many So you have to divide that by 6. Very good. So we're going to take 360. Excellent job. Divide that by 6. And so what do we get? 60. 60. So this was a 60 degree turn. 60 degrees. 60 degrees. 60 degrees. 60 degrees. And 60 degrees. See how we... Excuse me, figure that out? Yep. All right. Now, guess what these terms are called? Exterior angles. Exterior is something that's on the outside. A lot of times if um, somebody's looking at your house, they'll say the exterior of the house is brick. The exterior of the house is siding. 
the exterior of the house is wood, okay? So guess what the outside of the angles are called? Exterior angles. Yep. What about the angles on the inside? Vertex. Interior. Yes, this is the vertex. Good job. Oh. Yep. But what are these angles called? Yeah, interior. Interior angles. This is the interior of our house. You got it? Yep. What are these angles called? Uh, exterior. What about these ones on the interior? Inside? Interior. Very good. That is lesson 90.